afternoon. Good Look morning. Who's here. Um, she's not doing a good job walking like a Chicagoan, <laughs> so I'm gonna hold her. Alrighty, so we are at Wrigley Fields Chris Kennel Market. Before we were at the one in the loop. Yeah. This is the, the first, first year that they're doing, they're doing it. it. Matt lives around the corner, so we just walked over and we said that if we would have a Christmas They have their own Christmas tree. Yeah, oh my gosh. And this big old ice rink. Okay. Oh my goodness, look at this cheese. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Peter, did you see that? Look. Oh. So, we, we cracked. We cracked and we ordered one of those sandwiches. Matt also bought a scarf. We're just in a, we're in a spending mood. But he looks snug in that. Yeah. It's very warm. Eve's getting all the attention in the yeah. world. Yeah, she wants it. But uh, we got a ham sandwich. I think it's like the equivalent. Did you see the cheese place? Do they have one over here? No. So they don't have the same cheese place that we love from the original Chris Kindle Market. So this just might be this Chris Kindle Market's cheese place. But it was 12 bucks for that nice, uh, nice ham sandwich. Oh. <laughs> here it is. It looks amazing. You sure don't want the first bite? Yeah, thank you. You want to grow out. What? You're just looking at the table? Yeah. This is probably just as good as the cheese place or the other one. Yeah. And all the crumbs just got in Eve's tail. She's finally getting cold. Are you chilly? So we're gonna run back to the car because this girl, it's 30 degrees out. And I heard I think it's supposed to snow tomorrow. Really? Yes. I heard all day tomorrow. But we'll have to check. I don't know <laughs> if the person was lying to me or not. I don't know. Our Florida girl is struggling. We got her wrapped in a blankie. But she's shivering bad. We're running. <laughs> we're practically running back to the car. Candy canes and chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> Maddie, what like is this for? Uh, I want some melted. Oh, imagine, put it. imagine for him. There was, there was another one in there. Huh? Imagine what else did you want? There was another one. Was so so cool. I remember. Welcome to the Christmas party. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. Our Christmas Eve party has ended. It's nice. So my family's tradition is to have a party on Christmas Eve, but we've just gotten too big, so it just has to be whenever it can be. And so we still call it Christmas Eve, but it's Christmas Eve, Eve, Eve. Eve today. But last year was the day after Christmas. It just kind of depends. Yes, and we did a grab bag, and so you kind of put down a wish list of what you're looking for. And my grab bag is a little exciting for everybody who watches our videos because I asked for either two things. I said, here's a specific thing I want, or just get me Christmas sweaters, socks, goofy, serious, whatever. I'm going to love it. I'm really not picky. They went a little bit of both. So I got this awesome sweater with Santa on the beach that lights up. Get it? Florida. Santa. Florida. We live in Florida. Santa. We love Santa. It's all the same. And these cool reindeer hipster socks, which are funny. And the the, re the remaining amount they gave me just like cash for to buy what I asked for. What I asked for was equipment to, for the the theme park podcast that Dom and I are, are going to start. So I ordered the, put in the order. We should get them, I got them shipped here. So we should get them before we leave for Florida. So that means 
as early as two weeks, you may see our first podcast go live with Dom and myself. Yay! But Sarah got a dream come true for sure. Look at And it actually is like reversible so you can unzip it and it become like and you flip it outside and it's a just like a normal pillow. But I've been wanting this because we're gonna be traveling so much back and forth now. Because Sarah like truly needs help falling asleep. No, I anywhere. fall asleep anywhere. But it doesn't mean I'm comfortable. Yeah, you'll be so much more comfy. And then I got pearl earrings and I got these rhinestone earrings. And I can show you one of these things. We do also a white elephant. Um, what else? What are those called? Yankee swap. Um, it's where like you get a gag gift and bad like Santa. bad Santa, where you can like you get a gift, usually like up to ten dollars, five dollars, whatever you choose, and you wrap them, put them in the center of the group, and everybody takes a turn either taking a new gift or stealing from somebody who's already opened a gift. And this year, like I don't know where Sarah's. Sarah ended up with this really nice... I ain't gotten a good one. We both got good ones, I think. Sarah's is just more what we expected to be good. She got a, a mini, like a mini Mickey no, Mouse cooler. Yeah. Like Americana, like zip, rectangular Little cooler. zip of cooler drinks. Perfect for like drinks or a couple of snacks. Yeah. Perfect for the 20-hour road trip you we're about to take next week. Yeah, we brought in a big cooler because we didn't have a little cooler. So now we have a little cooler. But I got this little gem, which is all ceramic. Look at that coloring. It reminds me of Brooks Hedgehog. Yes, it reminds me of our friend Brooks Hedgehog. It's a hedgehog with the mouth is a little spot. It's a pitcher. So, there you go. I don't know what kind of drink you would put in a hedgehog pitcher, but when we figure that out, we'll be ready for it. But it's been a long day. Um, another crazy vlog. A little bit of downtown action. A little bit of family action. Tomorrow's going to be another low-key. I don't know if we said it. We like that Chris Kingo market. Yeah. Let us know what you than, think down below. And you guys know how much we love the we one in the loop. love that Chris Kingo market. The original in downtown Chicago. But that Wrigleyville one. Space. Seating. Christmas tree. More options for food. Not just fried cheese, but fried cheese sandwich. Yeah. Super nice. We had a great day. Uh, but with that. Oh, Eve did great. That was the only time during this whole vacation where she was going to be left alone. She was left alone for like four hours, and she she did great. You see, she's left alone for three, four hours on a regular basis. So she, we were nervous with her being in a different area at, at Sarah's mom's, but she did great. She was slept the whole time, so hopefully she'll sleep tonight. But thank you for following along on our adventures, even when we're not in Disney. We really appreciate it. Um, we have a lot of fun stuff coming our way as 2018 comes. With the vlog, with the parks, with yeah, I think we're gonna look think everything out, but we think a good chance we could get our universal passes this month of January. Podcast is a go, Universal's a go, Love and Life is always a go, Loving Each Other's always a go. <sighs> yeah, Got our, baby, we're gonna be an aunt and uncle very soon. We'll be an aunt and uncle very soon. We're going back to our baby doctor next week. So hopefully uh, 2018 brings a lot of babies and lots of love, lots of adventures. Yes. With that? It's good to be home. Right, Eve? It's good to be home. Oh, here she comes. She's eating her treat. She was intrigued by the hedgehog. Good night. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.